We're about to present some more exclusively here on the station live music uh, in the studio mixed hopefully for your listening pleasure the band tonight call themselves AFI they're going to be playing some shows and we'll talk about that we'll talk about Ukiah and oh my God. Oh, no we won't talk about Ukiah we'll get into that later but in the meantime we'll just uh, play some music and see how it works out give me a second to set this up and then live AFI on your Calyx I believe Naked Jeff starts this song, and here we go. Let's go! Nighttime sniffling, sneezing, coughing, aching, stuffy head fever, so you could rest song. We seem to have a studio syndrome of slowing down our songs. We'll try to fix that up before we... <laughs> studio syndrome. This is 90.7 FM. It's about a quarter until 10 Friday evening. If you're not going out, why don't you stick here? Because we've got live music another Friday evening on the Rick Sylvain Show. I'm Johnny Savage, and in the studio, 
You just heard a couple of tracks from AFI in the studio from your... If you could imagine yourself being me, there's in the basement, actually here in the studio... By the fireside. The whole damn band, and uh, I'll describe the band to you. The vocalist is Dave. As we go around the room clockwise, we've got Mark on guitar. Um, we got Jeff on bass guitar. Hi. And on the drums, Adam. Hi. Adam Start says hi. Um, Dave, you're the one by the mic, so I'll talk to you. AFI, a bunch of friggin' idiots. Yeah, that is close. That's as close as we can come. As we can. Honestly. Without the general manager trooping down here and, and pinching my ear. Very true. Um, what did we just hear? What were the songs? Uh, we just heard Who Said You Could Touch Me, first of all, and then we heard NyQuil, which um, NyQuil was off our live EP, Eddie Picnic's All Wet, and Who Said You Could Touch Me is also on that EP, but it's also on the Behind the Times EP. NyQuil is also on our first e split um, called Dork, which um, if any of you have, you're one of the chosen few because our guitarist Mark doesn't even have one. Wow. I have 12 He's them. impoverished. He is. Um, Jeff, has ha Jeff has 12. I have one. Mark has none. I was surprised to, to know that uh, more or less AFI have been together doing shows for the last couple of years. Yeah. And you know, where have you guys mostly been playing? Okay. Where, where could you have been found in the past? In the past, we could have been found in, uh, in Ukiah, California. About All four of you? All four of us. Wow. We were there. We were uh, eating pears, you know, chewing tobacco and all that stuff. And uh, we were in Ukiah, California for the first two years of our existence. We broke up for about eight months, got back together here in the beautiful downtown Berkeley area. And uh, since then, we've been playing here. Is it really true that your bass player, Jeff, is homeless? Uh, well, we try not to uh, dwell on that too much. <laughs> Nobody will accept them. Can't one of you guys put him up? That's what I can't believe. Uh, he Jeez. smells really bad. I... Hey, where, where, well, that where, where, can change. Where, 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 aren't you going to play tomorrow? Oh, I'm <laughs> getting to that. Oh, okay. uh, Rick Sylvain, go buy me some more beer. All right, um, yeah, uh, well, I like what I'm hearing so far, and I want to know where can other people besides me, we can't squeeze all the listeners into the basement of KALX, so where is AFI playing at next? Well, we're, okay, where we're not playing at next, someone okay. called... Okay, you were supposed to play in Petaluma? I guess, I don't know, someone said we were playing in Petaluma tomorrow? That was the unconfirmed. That's not real. We're unconfirmed not, rumor. It's a, it's a rumor, we're not playing in Petaluma tomorrow, so uh, if any of you were planning on going to Petaluma tomorrow, we're not going to be there. At the uh, Phoenix Theater. At the Phoenix Theater. We are, however. But. But. We are, however, playing at the Phoenix Theater on November 5th, which is a Saturday. Um, we're playing on the 14th of October. That's uh, next Friday. We're playing in Nevada City. And on the 15th, um, that's a week from tomorrow. A week from tomorrow, we're playing at the Punk Rock Mecca, 924 Gilman Street. And uh, we would we would just be pleased as punch if you would all come down and see us there. Cooperative effort. What's that, Jeff? Can't print it in the Chronicle. Oh, they can't print the address in the Chronicle? Not enough room. <laughs> oh yeah, it's a secret. <laughs> well, you know what's funny is um, somebody mentioned um, if you don't know where it is, you shouldn't go. I don't know what that means. Some people might think that's elitist. I don't know. AFI is here live in the basement of KALX and to play more music for you now if you feel... Do you feel somewhat ready? I'm Wait a minute. A Dave is going to uh, give himself a jolt. You want to hear it? I'm going to give myself a jolt. Here, listen. Oh, God. Woo! Ah. Oh, uh, wait, Mark's going to give himself a jolt really quick. Okay, now, that's, that's the, uh, the, the super caffeinated that cola. That would be high caffeine... Twice. I've never had one of those. Would you like to try? Oh, a why set? not? Oh, here you go. Here's right, my let's first see what jolt. Let's see. Here it is. First jolt. <laughs> oh, he's dead. He's on the ground shaking. Christ. Oh man, we gotta go. Thanks a lot. Jolt. Oh, we got jolts coming out of our ears. We're gonna get back and play some more music and talk more with AFI. What's uh, what's another song you wanna do for the Calix listeners? Uh, this song is to all those boys who are going to be throwing the pig skin around anytime soon. Uh, it's about football. All right, do it, AFI.
says hi. We all say hi. If okay, if anyone's listening to this, and you come to the show at 924 Gilman Street on uh, on next Saturday, and you watch us, and we say hi at the beginning, like we always do. Every time. The every time. Response would be. The polite response would be, as Miss Manners has taught you. <laughs> Tell, tell him, Mark, what would the polite response be? You say hi. Though. You say hi. It's great. You can wave, too. It's, you can you know, wave, cool. say hi. It's it's a really beautiful bonding thing. And it between, makes us feel welcome. You know, it, it makes us feel welcome. It's a great thing. What are we playing next, uh, yeah. Dave? Well, the next song we're playing here is, uh, is a song that you may have only heard if you had seen us before. And uh, it's called Half Empty Bottle. AFI KALX, seven minutes until the hour of 10 o'clock. We will have the Ride Finder as read by Rick Sylvain in seven minutes, but we're not anywhere near through with this band, born and bred in Ukiah. All of you grew up in Ukiah, basically? S not really. Or in the area, kind of, sort of? Yeah, it's a big, long story. It just, we don't even want to get into we it. We came together as, as a whole in Ukiah. Well, you, Ukiah is a whole. <laughs> Ukiah is a whole. Thank you. <laughs> You know what? That I, as I'm listening to you, I, well, what, did we, what was the songs we just heard? Tell me. Uh, we just heard High School Football Hero. That was the first one? That was the first one. And the second one was called Half Empty Bottle. And uh, as I'm listening, um, I would think there aren't a lot of people where you guys came together in Ukiah who like this kind of music, right? You know. There ain't no radio stations up there to play it. You know, how did you, how did you like, would like, you're the kind of guys like, I don't want to say the misfits, but like when you don't fall in line with everybody else. I mean, high school for me is like I don't. I'm never going back or whatever school. So when you got together, <laughs> what music obviously what you bonded on because ah oh, well I like this too and like everybody else can can suck because we know what's this is the best stuff. People didn't care about us. All right. <laughs> they still don't. They still don't care about us. They didn't care about us. They, they never will. And they never will. You are you are very very right. In but you're thinking. Are a lot of um, Dave? Do you do a lot of the lyric writing? Because you sing all the songs. Um, I write probably about sixty percent of the lyrics. And what does the rest of the band 50, do? Fifty, maybe forty percent of the lyrics. Hey, <laughs> well the rest of the, uh, Jeff writes the, the rest of the lyrics that I don't write. Mm-hmm. Um, the the ay 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 parts. The ay ay ay. Yeah, he goes ay 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 ay. That's the guy you heard in your <laughs> your right speaker, Jeff doing the backing vocals and ay ay ay. That's him. And. Uh, well, go ahead. What else? And then, How uh, does the band put it together? We, uh, well, usually, usually songs come first as far as musically, then lyrics just just flow from the from the inside of the mind. But it's, just looking so, at even at the, the like high school football hero, is that about somebody? Jeff. Uh, Jeff, is it about somebody that you knew? Back to the high school days. Actually, that, that song that song was inspired by a, a Popeye cartoon called "You Gotta Be a Football Hero." Inspired and, uh, by Popeye. Yes, because uh, Olive Oil uh, won't go out with Popeye because uh, Bluto is a football player and Ain't she's a story. Becomes a cheerleader for Bluto's football team and and Popeye has to win her back by becoming a football hero. Only from Ukiah would Popeye inspire punk. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. I anyway, um, AFI again will be playing 
next week at on Saturday night at, at Gilman, Gilman Street, Street, along with, do you know anybody else going to yes, be there? Yes, we're playing with Screw32. Who were here last who week. Who were here last week. Lovely boys. Boy, wh- joke a minute, that Andrew guy. Oh, yes, he is. If you're listening, Andrew, joke a minute. Joke. He, they're in uh, Sacto tonight. Oh, that's right. They're playing the Cattle Club yes, tonight. I'm naked. They're not I'm na- naked. <laughs> Screw 32, who else is on the bill? Uh, on the bill is also The Other, um, which is Bomber from RKL's new band. Um, multifacet Hellbender and the Mental Pygmies. What, um, you played Gilman before. What it, yes. When you moved down here, what, it, what was your impression of it? Like, this is it, this is a great place to come and play and hang out and yeah, meet it, people. And the first time we played at Gilman Street, well, <laughs> the first time we played at Gilman Street, oh. We, j- we jumped up on stage uh, a long time ago and played two songs to about four people. Um, Sitting on the couch. Right. Look at, yeah. May, we played there, and it was, it was just wonderful. It was a fun, fun thing. It's an interesting crowd, too. It's not just 14-year-old uh, girls. <laughs> but that's the main reason you guys are there, I know. Anyway, <laughs> let's hear another song from AFI, then we'll take a break, and then we'll be back and talk with them some more and round it out with maybe a couple more songs. If that's good to, good for you. Do you know what you want to do next? If yeah. so, let me position our sensitive stereo equipment, and this is AFI Live on your Calyx. Okay, this song's a new one. Hopefully you'll hear it someday on some vinyl. It's called uh, Your Friend and Mine. Hi, I just Hi. see you, and uh, you're hearing AFI. Oh, wait, I got to... And who's the winner? Yeah. I just dropped the Shout! Winner. Shout it! Oh, Shout man. Let it all out. <laughs> He's a wolf screaming lonely in the night. He's a blood stain on the stage. Vince Neil. Got anyway, what, what did we just hear? What was uh, that called? Your Friend and Mine? Yes, that was called Your Friend and Mine. And that was written about somebody. Uh, you had somebody in mind when you did I, wrote... You, come on. I might have. Okay. I might have there was had someone a, in mind. Someone who, who you know. The title, our titles, our song titles have uh, almost... Well, a lot of them have absolutely nothing to do with the lyrics. So the song title had something to do with, with this face. Everyone can see this. Ready? <laughs> that's, Wasn't that great? That, that's yeah, frightening. That's great. If you want to see the face that uh, Dave made, you'll have to go to 924 Gilman yeah. a week from Saturday. A week from tomorrow. Yeah. Everybody's got to come. Okay, it is 10 o'clock, straight up, 10.01 now, and this is KALX Berkeley broadcasting from the University of California, the UC Regents own our license, and the coolest thing about it is they never listen, and if they did, none of us would be here. 
<laughs> anyway. Can people um, call us? Uh, they sure can. If you want to talk to AFI while we're at the break here, the number is 642-KALX. You can ask them anything you want. Um, we're going to be back with you guys in a few minutes to play a couple more songs. Absolutely. And uh, in the meantime, this is the Ride Finder. This is the Rick Sylvain program, and I'm Johnny Savage. The music we have behind the Ride Finder today is Shot in the Dark by the Orange Mancini's. Kind of a nutty pink panthery kind of uh, Henry Mancini tune. We'll start off with this Calyx Ride Finder for today. Rides offered. Okay, it says 10 a.m. till 10 p.m. every day. Kevin's offering a ride from San Francisco to the Big Apple. October 24th is when he's hitting the deck. So if you want to leave, and that's the time frame, 415-668-3776 is Kevin's number. And Jennifer's headed for Madison, Wisconsin. Up there to the dairy land. Go milk a cow and pick some cheese off the tree. Around November 1st, Jennifer's leaving. 510-547-0747. Jennifer's number. Now over to the beggars who are looking for a ride. Get off that curb and stick out that thumb. Neil's going to Eugene, Oregon. October 8th. 574-6698. If that's your plans, too, give Neil a ride. Lisa's looking for a South Lake Tahoe gig. And she wants to leave October 21st, or weekends. I guess she's up there to gamble. 439-2451, Lisa's number if you're headed up to Tahoe. Chi town the Windy City, Janelle's looking for a ride, Tara. That place by the lake, October 20th. Hmm, is the day Janelle's leaving. And her number is 654-0847. And last but not least, those two beggars, Rebecca and Zach, just won't get off this list. Their day is almost numbered. Napa Valley Music Festival is their destination. 526-5126 is Rebecca and Zach's number. They want to leave sometime soon. I guess the 8th or the 9th now. 7th is gone. So uh, they, can, they can't drive. I guess there's some kind of traffic tickets or alcohol-related problem. But they have a cool tapes, they say. And they have gas. So if you want someone with gas in your car and you're headed to the Napa Valley Music Festival, Rebecca and Zach are your pair of flatulent people. That's the Alex Ride Finder. As always, 10 in the morning, 10 at night. Well, and I've been Rick Sylvain, and we'll listen to a little bit more of this, and then we'll get back to the action. Heavenly is coming to Berkeley. They've come all the way from Oxford, England to play a benefit show this Friday, October 7th at Stebbins Hall. But till I can see that you really care for me. Lois will also be there along with Maggie Jones and Pistol for the Coalition of Students United Against Prop 187. People say she's bad, but they don't see the way she is with me. P is for the P. The show is at 8.15 on Friday, October 7 at Stebbins Hall. That's at 2527 Ridge Road on the north side. For more information, call 849-0403. It's an all-ages show. It sure is, and they're probably already ra- hitting that thing. If you're not going to go up to the north side, Berkeley, uh, keep it here at 90.7 FM because we do have AFI Live in the studios here. They're keeping us here. And they're Help not us, they're please. not leaving. And uh, I was not very articulate in mentioning um, what I like about uh, AFI is the fact that from the small town that you came from, which we will no longer mention by request of Adam on drums, <laughs> please don't mention it anymore. But I, I, what I was trying to say was I think it's really great that uh, in spite of where the, the small town you were in, it was music that brought you together and uh, got you to hopefully a better place than where you were. And we'll hey. keep... Keep on doing good things. Nothing better than being in a band, I can tell you. That's true. So, AFI, Absolutely next week right. at 924 Gilman, November 5th, you're going to be where again? Uh, November 5th, we're going to be... Let me let me tell you where we're going to play. All right. You, well, you book... Uh, uh, we're talking to Dave, and you book the shows. Maybe. Yeah, I, I book the shows. So you do all the work. These guys get all the fun. Yeah, I do everything, oh, yeah. all by myself. Yeah, everything. <laughs> I do everything. Man, that's tough. Yeah, it's tough. So, okay, here's the shows that we're going to be playing. If you're interested on... Uh, October 14th, we're playing in Nevada City with I'm Really Not Sure Who. On October 15th, we're playing at 924 Gilman Street with Screw32, the other um, multifaceted mental pygmies and hellbender. On, uh, on October 28th, we're playing at the Berkeley Square with, with D.I., a band called Butt Trumpet and The Dread. And on October 29th, at 29th, we're playing at uh, Pill Hill Punk House with 
with Screw 32, um, Drive By Shopping Cart, I think, Black Fork, and uh, and then November 5th at the Phoenix Theater with uh, Screw 32, The Invalid, School Box, and on November no December 16th, we're having a uh, we're playing a record release party at 924 Gilman Street with uh, Dead and Gone, Screw 32, and Black Fork. Yeah. Record release party for you guys? Well, actually for all of us. There's oh, that's a big single. Yeah, that's the big... There's A, a seven-inch single with like 900 songs on it, right? Right, there's 900... Well, actually, there was going to be 900, but there's four songs. Okay. On it. And you have one on there? And we have one of those four. So if people like in Berkeley want to buy stuff that says AFI, can they go to the single section and find AFI singles? No. Um, only on, you're only on comps right now, right? No, we have singles. Okay, but we they're not singles. here. Well, you got to get them out there. Well, they're, they're here. Yes. They're well, they're here, here at Calix. You can request them at Calix. And as a matter of fact, somebody called and made sure to mention that one of the songs you're going to do in this next set is a dedication. Is that right? Well, not. Th it wasn't really wanted. Th th she just wanted to hear um, one of the songs that we're going to play. Okay. She wants us to dedicate it to her, but, I, you know, I, I wouldn't want it dedicated oh. to me. <laughs> if she only knew what the lyrics really said. But well, that's later. Well, do you want to do another song? Yeah, we'll, two? Do, we'll do uh, we'll do th about two more. Okay, what's the first song you're going to do, and then let me... Five or six more. <laughs> It'll only take ten minutes. All right. Um, what's, what's the next song you want to do? This is I Want a Mohawk, But My Mommy Won't Let Me Get One. Okay, this is AFI on KALX, and we reset the equipment now. This song is about somebody, not about the person we're dedicating it to. This goes out to no. Katie from... No, no, no. This is your name here. Your name here? Your that name is here. a surprise to me. Shut up, dude. Your name here. This song is about somebody.
shoobity wire. That's the Dean Martin version. <laughs> AFI live on 90.7 FM KELX, broadcasting at 500 strong Gonna sing some watts. Glenn Danzig for you. Uh, you know, <laughs> you are kind of bad. <laughs> Sorry. Danzig's all right. I like the Misfits better, and you guys probably did too. Yeah. I was just going to ask, we're talking to AFI. you got Dave on lead vocals, Mark on the guitar, Jeff on bass, and Adam on the drums. I'm naked. And <laughs> Jeff is naked, which is why my back has been to him the entire time. Yeah, but of course. <laughs> but of course. But of course. Uh, <laughs> nyah, nyah, nyah. Um, my name's Johnny, and this is the Rick Sylvain Live Friday Night Program, and uh, we're fortunate that <laughs> we're getting this off the ground. It sounds really good. I want to know, um, why punk? I mean, you play... Punk, or why not, you know, why punk, why not Counting Crows, or, you know, that kind of, what, what, is, what, what draws you guys to play this more than any other kind of music? Because you're good musicians, you could play almost anything you really wanted to. Energy uh, and speed. <laughs> skateboards. Yeah, that too. The devil made us do it. Thrasher Magazine made you do it. Thrasher Magazine made me do it. Uh, hey Dave, what are the secret words of praise? <laughs> the secret words Let word me tell you the secret words of praise. <laughs> Hail Satan, oh yes. <laughs> Woo! Praise. Hey, no, no, the devil did, I'm going to heaven. I'm going to heaven. What made us do it? I, uh, uh, skate yeah, I, Skateboarding? Skate you bonded on skateboarding and then went from skateboarding to music. Adam made us do it. It's, it's always the drummer's fault. I wanted to be a funk band. He made us do it. That was funk, right? Hi, Zandy. Funk. funk yeah. And it, it meant funk and it became punk. No, I, I wanted to be a... Uh, <laughs> I wanted to be a girl a, for a long time. A, a telephone repairman. Just a little girl. <laughs> what? what is it? Every time I get a lead singer here, it's a, it's a joke. It's Henny Youngman. Last week, Screw 32, we have Henny Young. Thank you. Oh, I love this man. Adam on drums. What a, what a, I love that. A king. He's a king. He's he won't prince. let me touch him. Well, I wouldn't. Whoop. It's a fight. Ow! It's a fight. Oh, God. Anyway, AFI here at Live at Scalic Studios, and uh, um, there's a kind of a record release party thing going on where and when again? Uh, that's in December. December oh. 16th. Oh, that's a, hol uh, a, Christ a Christmas thing. Uh, we're going to have a Christmas tree on stage. I'm going to wear a Santa Claus shoot, <laughs> and I'm, I'm going to come in through through the opening at the top of Gilman Street. All right. That's it's, good. It's going to be great. That's that's really good. Yeah, so I, it may hurt a little. I'm not going to be able to sing it. <laughs> Jeff on bass is not only naked, but he's... Belching. Belching. Quite, that was as good as anyone I've heard all day. Thank you very much. Very, and you thought Jeff wasn't talented. <laughs> this is 90.7 FM. How about, um, let's, let's uh, wrap it up by again mentioning AFI will be next week at uh, 924 Gilman, a Saturday night, and a whole lot of good bands as always. And if you don't know where it is, call Calix and we'll tell you. All right? Uh, that's next Saturday night, and uh, the next local show... After that is November 7th? No, the next local show after that is uh, October 28th at, at the Berkeley Square. At Berkeley Square. With D.I. D.I. So that ought to be good. What time do you guys be going on next week? Any idea? Probably around... We're playing last. Last. So you're headliner. We're playing last. So right. to speak. Yeah. <laughs> Headlining... Headlining Gilman. They're putting up a, a, a big banner on the top of Gilman Street. It says... <laughs> Ted. <laughs> Pay two dollars. You're gonna get a blimp. The blimp that you saw. There was a blimp there last week. No. There's a blimp flying over Gilman Street. Yeah, but what was a Green Day blimp? I mean, what? <laughs> uh, uh oh. Hey, I like Green Day. They're good guys. Well, not personally. <laughs> uh oh. No. Uh oh. I'd love to have a piece of their publishing. Uh oh. <laughs> anyway. So what? They're publishing. Money, money. Oh come on! God, it's Henny Youngman time. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, let's talk about. We didn't really talk about the last song. It was called "Your Name Here," and it was kind of a surprise. The bass player wanted to hear it. Yeah, it was and it's about somebody. Quite a surprise. No, you were the one who yelled it out. Well, because I heard him say it. Oh, you heard the guitar player. I was going to sing it. something else. I okay. did sing something else. And yeah, nobody listened to you. I sang "Bridge Over Troubl Troubled Water" is what I sang. At home. You couldn't even tell. <laughs> you joke, but I can tell. You're one of those mirror guys. Good morning. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, AFI, let's wrap it up with uh, whatever you want to play, and, and good luck. It's, it's really great meeting you guys, and I wish you the best of luck. Thanks a lot. So keep Thanks playing music, me. definitely. There's the metal part in this song. What? There's a metal part in this oh, last yeah, song? Oh, yeah, there's a metal part in this song. Well, this not about the comp. About the what? Well, the compilation? Oh, this is the song that's on the comp. Okay, this is the song that's on the compilation that's going to come out in December? In Dece well, no, we're going to... The party, the, the show is in December. I think it may be out in November. Okay, what's, do you know the name of the compilation or the label it's, it's going to be on? It's going to be on Zafio Records. 
and it's called This is Berkeley, Not West Bay. I don't even know why. Uh... That sounds great, and I hope it'll be available at all the cool record stores it'll, in the it'll, area. It'll be available at record stores. And I want to mention, this is Rick Sylvain's uh, Friday Night Live program on Johnny Savage, and next week at this time we'll have the local band Brilliant Teens, the Brilliant Teens, will be playing here next week live in the studio. So if don't go out on Friday night, buy a bunch of beer and sit and listen to as live as radio gets right here at Calix. So, what's the last song you want to do? This is a song, I want this song to be one where you say, We are AFI, this is what we're this, all this about. This will be the one. Okay, this will be the one. It's dedicated to Katie from San Diego. I, I don't know why. What, what's it called? Uh, it is called Love is a Many Splendid Thing. All right, good luck, and thanks for coming in, you guys. All right, thank all right. you. That is AFI live in Calix. Katie, uh, I hope you got like that. And uh, it was honest. It was honest, damn it. She asked for it. All right. Thanks, AFI, for coming in next week to Brilliant Teens. And uh, keep it here on Calix all the time. You never know what you're going to get, but for sure it's not what you'll get on the right side of the dial. Stay tuned for more Rick Sylvain until 12 midnight. This is Nirvana. I'm Davey from AFI, and you're listening to The Fabulous Zandy Show on KALX, Berkeley. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Thank you. Next. Do we have a second take if I accidentally go, hi, I'm having a hard beat.